It certainly surprises a lot of people to hear that most four-wheel drives don't actually drive all four wheels. At the heart of the problem are the open differentials that come standard on most new Forbies. While they're essential for life on the road, they can easily come unstuck out on the dirt. The solution? Installing an ARB air locker system for both the front and rear end, which should effectively eliminate the shortcomings of a standard differential with a flick of a switch. With the locker, the compressor and the necessary switch gear installed, all that's left now is to test it out. Righto, Matty, bring her out. Well, the air locker system that we've installed today is like any bit of four-wheel drive gear. It's only as useful as the bloke behind the wheel can make it. So how do you get the best out of your four-wheel drive? And you, that's what we're gonna look at today. The test track here at ARB Cooper's Plains is designed to simulate a typical off-road hill climb. The movable track can be manipulated with all sorts of ruts and bumps, ranging from easy to extreme. No good, mate. Well, here we are, same hill, same car and the culprits are the differentials. They're taking that engine power and they're delivering it all to the wheel with absolutely no grip. Now, because we've fitted diff locks to this vehicle, we're gonna completely override the normal differential action. With a flick of the switch, whatever this wheel did, that wheel's gonna to do too. With all four wheels engaged, there's plenty of traction to push on up the hill. Not only does this get us out of trouble, but it also means we're not screeching or spinning wheels, which is in turn much kinder on the tyres and the terrain. And of course, the lockers are just as handy when you're going downhill. If you're on broken ground, you're not going to lose traction and the car won't run away with you. But if you've got the lockers in and it's still running away with you, you've got to ask yourself, what were you doing on that hill? Of course, while the test track is great for demonstration, it's out in the real world where these diff locks really come into their own. If you're driving on the beach, I'd recommend leaving the diffs open until you get into trouble and need that bit of extra traction to get out of the bog. If you're crossing a stretch of water, then flick the switch on the way down in case it gets slippery midstream and you need a bit more momentum to keep moving. Or alternatively, if you need just a little extra traction on a slippery surface like a boat ramp or a building site, a flick of the switch can save engaging hubs and selecting four-wheel drive. You can check out the full range of ARB off-road touring accessories on the website, as well as find the location of your nearest store. So the beauty of that air locker button is it really does give you the best of both worlds. You've got normal diffs, normal driving, and when the going gets tough, it's just a matter of push that button and you're out of trouble. <laughs>